Okay. Okay. So what we have here today is a demonstration of Gorilla Glass 3. This is going to highlight the retained strength of Gorilla Glass 3. Uh, what we've got here are several glass samples that have been scratched with a 7 Newton scratch. And that's basically been done with a diamond and denner. And you can see in this sample where there's a scratch between the two black dots. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to start out with an alternative alumina silicate glass which is on the market today. And we're going to take this glass that has been scratched and we're going to do a dynamic impact. So you're going to put a ball in there? Yes. A steel, yep. a steel ball? Yes. We're going to use a 135 gram steel ball. We're going to do a dynamic impact. Here we have a 10 degree angle on an inclined plane. And we're going to keep an eye on this glass sample right down here when we drop it. Smash. This is currently available glass on the market that is not corning. So it's from your competitor, clearly. It's alternative alumina silicate. Okay. And you can see that sample broke. So what we're right. going to do is then compare that to Corning Gorilla Glass 3. And you can see we have the same setup. Now the scratch is much less visible. And if Dave was describing to you earlier, we basically created a feature in the glass where it doesn't create lateral cracks as easily. So it's not as strength limiting. Um, what we're going to show is take that same test, drop the ball again, and the glass will survive the impact at that point. Do you want to do a couple more tests? Well, we're going to crank it up a little higher. So, oh. Yeah, we're going to keep going. So what we're going to do is take it up three times higher in energy. And just to show the amount of energy that's here, we have a, an aluminum plate that's the same thickness as the glass. And this is just to demonstrate the amount of energy that we're imparting into the glass. And you Love can it. see that puts a really nice dent in the aluminum sheet. Sure did. Yep. So we'll do the same thing with Gorilla Glass 3. Again, this has a scratch in it, 7 Newton scratch, same as what I was describing earlier. I'm going to go ahead and impact this. See, it's still Nothing. intact. Do you want to do a couple, a couple more of those balls down there? Well, I'm going to do, I'm going to do one more thing Whoa. Before, we, uh, before we finish. <clears throat> so we're going to take this sample out just to show you the added retained strength with this sample. We're going to put it inside of this standard ring-on-ring -ring test fixture. I'm going to load this up and I'll spin this around so you can see the dial gauge. I'm going to put a hundred pounds of force on this. And that's with that scratch on there. That's with that scratch on there. Yep. All right. It's still so retaining let's see what strength. That's yep. And the rings that you see on here is because we have a safety tape on here. Okay. And that's so that will leave a dent from the rings. That's what not is, a dent in the glass. What does the back look like? Just I'm just kind of curious. See. So nothing. That's amazing. Yep. That's great. Yep. Gorilla Glass 3. Yep.